Prior to using the polis, please remove the cover. Okay. All right, so now we'll discuss the different features that you have with the polis unit. As you look at the screen here, um, to the left, this is going to be the high, medium, low settings. So I'm going to show you the different modes. Low, medium, high. Now this F denotes full arch. Your other option will be S for single tooth function. This is for your ultrasound. Now the only way you'll be able to tell the ultrasound is working is when you activate the unit. I'm going to activate it and show you. And you can see the ultrasound is now activated. This is the air ionizer that will always be working as soon as it is plugged in. It's going to be passively cleaning the air around the unit. And this is the fan. And again, as I start the session, you're going to see the fan actually working as well. Okay. Now this will allow you to make variations on your time that you want to use. So if you want to increase your treatment time, you can bring it up or bring it down. And of course, this is the height function. So that allows you to bring the unit itself for the head above and below. We have the treatment guide function. That will allow you to look at the different treatment protocols you might want to choose from when it comes to treatment plans, for example. As well as how to control teeth sensitivity, avoiding color rebound, and home whitening and maintenance. All right, um, as you look at the fan here, you can see it's turning and you can actually hear it as you get a little bit closer to the head itself. When the unit stops being used, the fan will stay on for some time afterwards. And the idea behind that is just to cool down the halogen bulb to make it last longer. So when that happens, please leave the unit alone and let it cool down by itself. And it will automatically turn off once it's finished and then you can shut it down for the day. So, if you're ever in a situation where you need to calibrate the unit, this is how you can do it. You basically want to tap onto the screen within this first box. You'll hear a beep, and then it's going to reset. And then you just want to gently touch each corner as it shows, as the cross shows. Okay, so we have two buttons that can be found at the bottom of the unit. Um, is you hit the button, the second button from your left, as you face the unit, you'll notice that this light turns on and that this is going to go blank, as you can see here. Now, we added this uh, option. If you're in a situation where there might be some sort of electrical outage, but you still want to finish with your treatment. So the electronic may be out, but the light will still work. So you can finish your last session. And then after that, you can let your patient go. Now you push the button again, to turn that light off and it brings it into an off position and then it comes back as it normally would. Now the other red button, the button that is to the to your left as you face the unit, what this will do is it will bring the unit into its default position. It will bring it all the way down. That's to make it easier to ship if you're in a situation where you want to do some warranty maintenance. So with the Polis Advanced Ultra Unit, um, we have two secret red buttons and we keep this for just very, very unique or rare occurrences. Um, this one here will allow you to basically turn the light on and off as you need and bypass the electronic section of the unit. So that's a situation where if you may have some sort of electrical outage, and you still have a patient that still needs the remainder of their treatment done, you can just turn the electric on from here. Now this other button with the red ring around it, that will allow you to bring the head all the way down into the default position, again, without having to use the electronic section. So you basically were to push and to hold that, and that will bring the light all the way down to default. So you'll notice on the front of this unit, it says UV proof. Um, the purpose of this cover is with some dental offices, they may use um, UV light for their sanitation procedures. 
So in a situation like that, this cover will protect the unit itself from UV light, so it'll keep it from fading, for example.